What's up guys, PG here, hope you're having a wonderful day. Welcome back to a new video. In this one, we're going to talk about Tesla Safe and reasons why I think that Tesla Safe is different from other projects and why it's worth taking a look at. It's a question that I've been receiving and I've been talking about it with, with subscribers on Instagram and, and by email. I've been receiving a lot of emails asking me why Tesla Safe, what's different than pre-sales or projects that are just getting launched and also there are key factors that uh, we talked about in the previous video when I said what I really like about Tesla Safe, really important factors that just makes me love Tesla Safe. But um, right now, let's take a look at what makes Tesla Safe different from other projects and why I think they're they're really great. So here, first thing that makes them different is the team. They have a really great team. You don't, you maybe don't know the team, but um, you can get to know them if you take a look at the admins and the. Uh, they're a team of great developers from different backgrounds, but in general, they're very, very knowledgeable and very great devs, which is a uh, rare to see honestly these days with new projects or just getting launched. You see a lot of young people launching projects because it's honestly, it's not that difficult to launch a project. What's difficult is to keep a project relevant and to keep a project interesting for people and just having people just having hope and seeing the vision and have the same vision for the project. So that's what's more difficult. Launching a project, that's one of the easiest thing to do now with the code, etc. You can launch a project in two seconds, but um, having people actually believe in the vision, trust the vision and uh, keep on following and keep on being in is the hardest part. And Tesla Safe is just doing that amazing because they have experienced devs their devs have been working in Silicon Valley, which is always a really, really great thing for Tesla Safe. And uh, that's the first thing that sets them apart here. The devs, the team, also the community of Tesla Safe is amazing. The whole Fusion community, if you know about Tesla Safe, you know that there's the whole Fusion blockchain. It's just that's amazing. Just the whole vision that they have for it and the whole community in the Telegram is amazing. So that's part of the just the community, the devs and the people behind Tesla Safe, which is amazing and which what, in my opinion, is what sets them apart from, for example, a 16 year old or 18 year old who just wants to create a project, gets hype around it, but um, doesn't really know what to do with, with, with 2000 people following the project and they're just inexperienced. Maybe they will learn, but um, it usually won't be successful and you will see a lot of projects be a failure because of that reason alone. So here, six the experienced devs is one of my favorite reasons why I think that Tesla Safe is different from the rest. Now, a lot of diff a different reason that's also really, really great is just the market cap holders. Tesla Safe is, is at a crucial point right now where it can just literally take off in the next coming weeks, next coming months, because the market is getting more bullish they're just getting started since April and they have a lot of holders here. You can see 8,000. So they're a great number, a great milestone with 17.9 trading between 17 and 18 million market cap. So close to 20 million. It's a, a really great number to go to the next level. The next level would be 100 million. So um, there's going to be 20, 20 million and then 100 million, which is a 5x from here. So um, that's something that can play out in the next coming weeks, next coming months based on everything that they will start to to unroll and uh, it's going to be amazing to see so um that's also the reason why i think that system apart they have a crucial level 20 million and uh that's currently that's uh, mostly the level where a project goes from 20 to 100 million and where they just break that barrier and become a really established project and then go from 100 to a billion and when they go into the billion zone that's where they, they attract the big the big money and that's where it gets even more exciting but first, I would love to see them go to 100 million market cap. That's gonna that's gonna be an amazing ride for Tesla Safe. Another big big reason, and uh, you probably know it, why I think that sets Tesla Safe apart from all the rest, is here, the roadmap. And uh, I think that people are getting way too lazy with the roadmap. I think that uh, I see honestly every single day, five, ten. I just go to the website, 20 projects that I go to the website. For example, it can be fire launches or pre-sales. I go to the website. And I see always the same roadmaps over and over again. So I think that that's a big, big reason why Tesla Safe is different. It's just the roadmap. 
you can see here april july august september usually that's when the, the even let's let's be fair here it goes to, to to december 2021 and that's when projects usually 99 percent the roadmap stop from there and in the roadmap you have coin gecko listing coin market cap and uh maybe nfts it stops there so um you really can judge from that project that the project is not really experienced that they just copy the roadmap and that they want to go for there's a big chance that the, maybe 90 percent of a chance that they won't go for with this roadmap because uh, it's just been done over and over and over again and people want just great roadmaps with some innovation and with new things and that's where tesla safe comes in you can see here i don't think you have really seen a roadmap that looks like the roadmap of tesla safe you can see here they're really professional they have really great goals and they have a really great vision and they're trying to make it different it's honestly something that i haven't seen before you don't see it if you take a look at every single day project you don't see that kind of roadmap every single day so um, that's a big reason why i like tesla safe you can see everything that they have planned and what's even better you can see here 2022 2023 2024 2025 yesterday i was in a voice call i listened to a voice call and i, I listened to people uh, people a question someone asked where do you see the, the project go in 2025 a different project that just was getting launched and the dev was just even laughing at the question like um what are you talking about 2025 we don't plan that long and we don't even think about the project being around in 2025 so that's the first red flag that you see in, in meme coins or projects that are just getting launched is that people the creators the devs don't even have the 2025 vision they just think about making a quick buck making a smart way to get the money out and just go to another project and that's what we see for 99% uh, of the time in those spaces with early projects and then you have just unicorns who stand out who try to make things different like tesla safe and uh, that's why i love tesla safe and why i think that tesla safe is different from all the other projects the roadmap since day one that's the thing that just stood out to me the roadmap and how different it was and just how great it looked and um, that's what made me love Tesla Safe in the first place, the roadmap and the vision of the team, of the devs. So, um, yeah, I think that those three reasons are valuable reasons that make Tesla Safe stand out and that uh, can actually be really beneficial for Tesla Safe, for the holders, for the team, and something that can just bring Tesla Safe to the level of the big boys. 100 million more cap a billion more cap and maybe from there 10 billion 15 billion 100 billion so those are some key levels that um, i'm going to take a look at and i can't wait to see tesla safe reach those levels i can't wait to see the whole fusion blockchain reach those levels so that's going to be amazing and um yeah those are the reasons i hope i responded to the question and uh, i've been thinking i've been talking about it w uh, through dm with some people who have been asking me why what makes what makes tesla safe different than for example a new token that's just launched for example this one or this one and this one and uh, i always say but take a look at the roadmap take a look at the dev take a look at the community take a look the dev team community roadmap and just the holders and what they think about tesla safe and i think that you you're going to be surprised to hear that it's actually very different than 99% of the projects that are getting launched or that are around right now. So I um, hope this was helpful. Hope that, um, yeah, this was helpful to you and uh, that I responded to the questions. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, you can leave a like, you can subscribe. Remember that everything I said is for entertainment purposes only, no financial advice. Thanks for everything. Thank you for your support and I'll see you in the next one.